It is April and another birch box is here. Being the bachelor that I am, I just happen to have a nice little knife sitting on my uh, coffee table. Yeah. Yeah, it's a little dirty, but whatever. I was actually on the birch box site last night uh, looking at a couple things. And uh, you can actually see the content of your box before it even arrives. Um, there's a clone in here that's $105. For 100 milliliters so i'm curious as to uh how good it really smells so that's in here i have some socks i know that are going to be in here a beer elixir which is great so uh yeah here's the card it's talking about everything that's in here so english laundry i absolutely love anytime i get anything english laundry because this shit smells fucking amazing excuse my french but Literally, it's the best smelling cologne that there is um, for the signature, and in, 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 in my opinion. Uh, so, boom, English Laundry 3-in-1. So the bottle looks a little different than the one that uh, I saw online. So, ooh, 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 that's sticky. Yeah, this stuff smells so good. But the bottle isn't filled up all the way, boo. But, uh, it's a little gooey there. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's, um, the stuff. I had this, the sample last, last month, and I unfortunately lost it. Uh, and when I was in Austin, uh, I went to South by Southwest and literally squirted it a little bit on. And, and as soon as I, like, was walking downtown, this girl was like, oh, is that you that smells amazing? So, uh, that's all you need to know about that cologne. I mean, it's light, it's, it's, it's confident, it's masculine, it's, uh, it's, you know, it's, it's great, if you ask me. I love clones that aren't extremely overbearing. Uh, so, stubble and stash, and I actually just shaved. So, actually, I'm showing you the wrong thing. This is stubble and stash, face moisturizer, and beard conditioner with uh, aloe, argan oil, jojoba, uh, Camille green tea vitamins A and E and pro vitamins B5. This is an, actually a um, Exfoliator I was reading about this as well um, it has uh, Papaya micro crystals and aloe and it actually has something in it to help loosen up uh, the bond between dead skin cells I was actually like really reading about it. It has a uh, um, Let's see if it says anything. I'll just read you what it says real quick. It says, dramatically improve your skin's texture to reveal softer, brighter, and younger looking skin. Triple action formula brightness with powerful papaya enzymes to give radiance. Exfoliates with dermatologist grade microcrystals and gently cleanses with aloe vera, coconut, and pinnacle. Let's see what this smells like. Sounds like it would smell interesting. Doesn't really have a smell. So. And so, so let's see what this smells like. Actually, I think there's a seal in this one. Yeah, there's a little tiny seal. Get that off. This smells interesting. But it doesn't my beard. Actually, wow. This smells like hmm. can't really describe what this smells like but it's something I would wear at night I wouldn't really uh, wear it out because I don't, I don't particularly like the smell of it um, it doesn't smell bad but it's not something I would want on me when I was going out or something uh, mm -hmm. and then these socks which some people complained about, they said they slide off, they probably slide off my feet because regular socks slide off my feet because they're big as hell. And uh, these are supposed to be socks when you don't want to wear socks. So if you have a pair of loafers or some kind of classy shoes and you don't, you know, want your want socks to, you know, look all tacky, um, you put these on and you could be wearing socks and your feet don't get sweaty and whatever. And uh, although my feet don't, I mean, I'm sure they sweat, but my feet don't get like crazy. I'm not one of those people that has to worry about body odor and shit like that. Um, damn, what the hell is this holding this together? 
so I I do wear shoes without socks a lot actually um, but we'll try these around the house and see if they slide down and if they don't I mean these are some funny looking socks let's uh, try these on <laughs> I don't know if these will fit on my foot. Oh, they do fit. But, uh, can you see that? I'm not sure I would really rock these because they look kind of, I don't know what the word is I'm looking for. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, I would probably not take these out of the house. Uh, but the shirt I got last month was the first clothing. Oh, there's two pairs in here? You're shitting me. Uh, uh, and here's this $100 cologne. Let's, I mean, this is the sample. Look what it came in. It's like got a postcard, a sticker, all this deal. I'm anxious to see what this smells like. Uh, so two pairs of socks. That's not bad. You know, you can always use socks. These are a little odd, but, uh, you know, part of the reason why you have birch box is you want to stand out from the crowd. So it's no show with loafer socks, turkish combed cotton, uh, feet sweat no matter who you are. <laughs> <laughs> I stand corrected. Protect your feet and shoes when going sockless and stay comfortable throughout the day. Our loafers, our loafer socks are truly invisible and won't slip off thanks to silicon grips that we placed in the heel and added and the added snug arch support. There are some little weird dots. I don't know if you can um, see that or not. Or what the lighting looks like on that. Um, but if you can see those little dots right there. But uh, I'm going to wear these around and I'll update you next month on a video or either on my blog and let you know how how well these, how well these stay up. Because like I always have a problem with socks staying on my feet um, and it drives me insane. Um, but it's not, I mean, so if, these, if it happens with these, I wouldn't be disappointed because it happens with just about every brand of socks I get. Uh, I just have a foot that's in that weird odd size that I'm a 12, but uh, socks that I get generally say they fit a 12, but they don't. Or they do for a little while, and then once they, you know, get broken in, they start to slip off, and it's, I mean, I'm sure you.